This is a 1954 Lakin Capri convertible. It's an auction car at the Meekum auction. It's red with a black uh, top. Beautiful condition. And it's a very low mileage car in the 30 some thousands. So it's uh, <laughs> unbelievably low mileage. Amazing that uh, cars like this uh, really do exist. There's the complete wheel covers, full wheel covers, Capri badging there. And uh, I could, of course, open the doors here on this car. And inside we have a beautiful uh, dashboard, lots of style here. And it looks like uh, cockpit uh, controls. Very nice. And it looks like it's the last year for the four-speed hydromatic that they were buying from General Motors. The following year, in 55, they would have a bigger engine, and they would also have uh, a, a three-speed turbo drive transmission that Ford produced. Beautiful red and black two-toning here in the interior. Pull-down armrest in the back. Power windows, as you can see. This would have a 317 uh, cubic inch displacement engine. And of course it had the overhead valves. And there's the hydromatic. You see the 4 and the 3. Four speeds and three speeds. The three speed would knock out the uh, overdrive fourth gear. That'd be for in town cruising. And looking around the back, notice the cathedral like uh, taillights with the backup lights underneath it. Beautiful red piping on that convertible top. Plenty of chrome here. And we have fender skirts here and wide white walls. And in a minute I'm going to open the passenger door, get another view inside. Notice how elaborate that steering wheel is with a full circle horn ring. Certainly the sign of a very uh, classy car. It's unusual for convertibles to have pull down armrests in the back. And this one has it. All right, now we're going to open the hood to take a look at that uh, overhead valve V8 engine. And here we have it. And you can see the under hood area is just as tidy as the rest of the car. There you can see the power brakes there. Beautiful air cleaner, nice valve covers. And the power steering. And of course we have a, uh, I would assume it's an electro-hydraulic uh, power top. And of course the power windows. Beautiful car.